Yo, what's going on guys? So as you can see by the title and probably why you're here, this is how you get custom music on Spotify. But before we actually get into it, I do have to clarify something. So first thing is that if you don't want to pay attention to this, you can actually just skip to the parts you need with the timestamps on screen now. They're also in the pinned comment below. But actually getting to the things you should probably know, you will need Spotify premium for this. So if you're on a free account, you cannot do this. So kind of lame, but that's Spotify for you. Then other from that, you will have to be on the same Wi-Fi as your computer and your phone. So if you have two different Wi-Fi's, you will need to be on the same Wi-Fi. And yes, you are going to need a computer and your phone for this to actually do it. Then other from that, I also want to thank Taken for letting me using his Spotify premium account. Since without that, I would not be able to do this. But yeah, other from that, as per usual, I do do Windows first and Mac later since most people are on Windows and if you're looking how to do this on Apple Music you can look in the top right hand corner of your screen now since I have done this on Apple Music but yeah without talking anymore let's just get straight into it. So starting on Windows this is definitely going to be way harder than Mac but what I do is that I'm just looking for a song off YouTube if you're looking for mixtapes or anything datpiff.com is a good source you could use but all I do is I go to YouTube, type in the song I want, which is Long Time from Playboy Cardi, just Slow Down, which is a banger song if you have not heard it. So all I do is I grab it. Then once you grab it, all you do is copy and paste the URL of it. Then you go to YouTube to MP3, which I just type in YouTube for some reason. But all you want to do is go to YouTube to MP3 converter. And once there, all you have to do is just type in the URL and you just let it download. Now, this is at 500% speed downloading. So... Once it's downloaded, all you press is the download button, which it's it's it takes a couple of seconds since it's a small file. But once here, all you have to do is go into your Spotify, and this is where it gets really tricky. And again, it is much more of a pain to do this on Windows than Mac, and it's much more of a pain to do it on Spotify in general than Apple Music. But you should be able to do it. It might take you some trial and error, but yeah. All you want to do now is that I go into my files and you are going to have to make a new folder for this and I just call it music and I put it in there but once in Spotify you go into the little triangle thing then you go into settings then once down here I actually left it on but right here it says local files it's going to be turned off for you, you turn that on press add source then that music file you just made with that song in it you're going to put that in there and then when you look on your left where it says your library you're going to see local files now for here it's going to have a lot of songs because I actually have a lot of Logic mixtapes in here so all I do is I just find it which it's actually called Playboy Cardi not just long time intro which yeah but once you find it I would make sure you make sure it works so I play it and I made sure it works which it does you're not going to hear it because it's copyright but then add it to a new playlist or a playlist you have go to that playlist and you want to press download and now uh, what I recommend here is that also on your phone and again this is going to have to be on the same Wi-Fi to actually work to get it on your phone wait for this playlist and make sure the songs in the playlist you have it on your phone then at the exact same time press download and once there it should download and it should be fine but I have had several times where it does it just does not want to work so what I found out that sometimes works is that if you just keep playing it on the computer and download it on both phones it'll eventually work which is weird since again it's Spotify and I'm not like the biggest Spotify user and I don't know exactly what I'm doing but it does work eventually and as you can see it will eventually work on your phone so just download it both at once and just keep playing on the computer until you get it on your phone then you should have it on your phone and now you can listen offline with your phone so yeah it's pretty simple on Windows just a little hard but other from that let's just get straight on to doing it on the Mac now that we're on Mac, this is definitely going to be a lot harder than Windows since that's just from what I found out. It works a lot better on Mac than Windows, so all you want to do as like normal is grab whatever mixtape or song you want from YouTube, but I'm using a mixtape, so I'm going to dapiff.com since they have a lot of mixtape that Apple Music and Spotify probably won't have, but for me, I'm using Logic's old mixtapes as an example since I know they're on here, but in reality, I already have all these mixtapes downloaded since I use them for my Apple Music, but just press download. I know it looks a little sketchy, but trust me, it's fine. It'll work, and once you have it downloaded, it's pretty simple from here. It's almost exactly like Windows. You just want to go back into your Spotify, go into the top right, then you're going to press settings, which pretty similar. Then all you want to do is go down to local files. For me, it's turned off, but Turn it on, then add source, and you want to add whatever mixtape you want. So, for me, I just added a random mixtape that I found, which I think was Days Before Rodeo by Travis Scott. But 
once you'll see when I actually go into my local files, it's going to be really cluttered with a lot of useless stuff because I actually make beats on this Mac. So there's a lot of useless like loops and all that. So just a lot of stuff that's going to be a little like eye popping for you, but it will not be like this when you use your thing unless if you have other files enabled in here. So it should just be whatever mixtape you had or whatever song. So don't be worried. It's not going to be this cluttered when you look at it, but as like the windows, all you want to do is find whatever song or mixtape and just add it to a playlist. And from here, it's pretty similar to Windows, so I just had this random song, 5am by Logic, which actually is a banger to a playlist. Then, as per usual, go to that playlist, which you might have to find. Then, like I said before, I recommend you wait for this playlist to be on your phone as well, and you press download at the same time as your Mac and your actual phone, so it just downloads at the same time, which... I don't think you have to do that i just feel more comfortable doing it and it just gives me more of like a certain that i'm doing it but it should download to your phone then once on your phone you should be fine you can play it and now you have it on your phone and your mac which again this worked first try for me which was really weird because i was not expecting it to work first try but mac definitely works way better than windows but yeah that's pretty much about it that's how you download songs to your spotify i might do later how to add custom music art if i can find out how to do that but once again i want to thank take him for letting me using his spotify premium account because you do need spotify premium so i left his socials in the description below make sure you go gas him up but other from that make you make sure you leave a like comment and share with your friends your parents i don't care just share it please but yes as per usual until next time youtube see you